Baird says, you know, is from reflux and you were basically at this stage. So you weren't at cancer, but you were at that stage. The fact that we actually have this technology available in Alberta, that we can actually treat Albertans and in many ways cure them of cancer before it even happens. What else can you do better in medicine than prevent cancer? Barrett's esophagus is a condition in the esophagus lining that happens from chronic reflux or heartburn. In a small number of people, they develop precancerous cells and eventually one in 200 of those will develop cancer. My dad had esophageal cancer. He went into the cross for one treatment of radiation and he passed away the next week. So it's uh, familiar and so it's very important uh, to take care of this. When I first met Paulette, and that was 2021, she actually had a lot of Barrett's, and those cells were high risk. She was at the last step before cancer. Say this is the lining of the esophagus. Then the balloon actually would inflate, and so we can actually generate the inflation there. And there we see an ice crystal form. And this area is minus 80. We have to kill the cell of the lining of the esophagus and have your body actually replace normal lining in its place. It's the most minimally invasive type of, of treatment because we're not cutting, we're not doing surgery in that area. Everything is done through the endoscope. to just burn deep enough to kill those cells, but then force the body to grow uh, normal lining back. Compared to that first picture where you were all um, Barrett's, this is essentially, if someone looked at your, your lining now, they would e never even know that you ever had Barrett's. Wow. Well, if Dr. Ferguson looked at it, he wouldn't even know. In the field of surgery, we've moved from big surgery to minimally invasive. This is even less minimally invasive than, than the surgeries because we're not cutting the skin. We're doing everything from the inside. 